so tonight's episode is going to be really short because it's really late and I'm trying to prepare to go to Phoenix and um, it's short but it's got good content. Christmas time has arrived and Christmas came early this year. I got my drone last Friday. All right, let's go in here to the gym and talk about this a little bit. So this is it, Mavic Pro. I've flown it a few times already. I'm, uh, I'm really liking it so far. I've never had a drone before, um, and it's really easy to fly. There's a lot of settings because there's a lot of technology built into it, so I will be working on learning the settings um, and uh, just trying it out. I'm going to take it to Arizona. I can't promise I'll get to actually fly it on the golf course because I don't know what the regulations out there are. Um, Friday, we're playing a golf course called Kierland. It's at a resort. It was a really good deal. It was like a $225 round of golf I got for $100 each. And they have golf boards there, so I may... We may rent golf boards Friday. I'm gonna be taking a ton of video with my new iPhone because um, the camera on the, the new iPhone that I have is really good. I'm actually using it right now. Um, yeah, so got the drone. I'm going to Arizona in day after tomorrow. Playing TPC Scottsdale Stadium course Saturday at 11.20. Me and my friend Joe, we have a caddy. Well, we have a four caddy. They're required, which is surprising. Um, hopefully he doesn't care that I have the drone. And if he doesn't, I'm going to put it up in the air and let it follow me for a few holes. Because that's part of what this thing does is automatically follow you. Um, let's see. What else? So, what else? So, I weighed in this morning. Really excited about that. I'm down 19.6 pounds, and the, the main reason I'm excited about that is because I was talking to some people about their weight loss journey, and they said once they got to 20 pounds, that's when their stomach, and that's when they really noticed their stomach to get smaller, and I'm really waiting for that because I'm ready to start wearing some nicer golf clothing, and I don't want to purchase anything new right now because I know I'm going to be a completely different size and shape in the spring. So trying to hold off on buying too much. Um, what's really nice is I'm starting to fit into some shirts that I wasn't able to fit into over the last couple years. That's pretty exciting. Um, so yeah, short episode. Just wanted to show you guys the drone. There it is again. As you can see, like it's tiny, so I'm holding this you know, in my hand, um, right up here. It's got a cover on the camera and the gimbal, the stabilization part of it. Um, actually, uh, let me show it to you guys um, folded up. So that's it. It is super compact. Super compact. Uh, I'll walk upstairs in a second and show you the carrying case for it. It's a small leather carrying case. It holds... The drone, it holds the controller, it holds a couple extra batteries and the charging stuff for it, which is awesome because if you know anything about drones up to this point, it takes a lot of room up to, to store it and to, to, uh, to try to be mobile with it, to carry it places. Um, this one, barely any room, it takes up like barely any room. I can have this drone up in the air in a matter of minutes. It's It connects to all the satellites it needs to. The last time I flew it, it was connecting up to like 18 satellites. So it's very smart. Um, it's safe, it's secure. Uh, it has obstacle avoidance. So I can fly it directly at me. And right here on the front, you can see those two kind of dark areas. That is the, those are the sensors, the front facing sensors, and it will stop within like three meters of me and it will not let me fly it any closer. It has return to home features, so 
if I just say return to home, it comes back to me. That's really useful if I'm flying and I kind of lose sight of it a little bit. It'll come back to me automatically. Uh, the batteries are intelligent flight batteries, so they know when to return to me if they're losing power. That's really important. The last thing I would want is to lose this $1,400 drone because of wind or because of something, you know, that has to do with the batteries. So yeah, lots more to come with the drone, hopefully to get some golf footage for you when I get back from Arizona in the warm weather. It's supposed to be 72 and sunny when we play this weekend, but here in St. Louis it's going to be about 25, so I'm glad I'm going this weekend. Um, that's about it. Excited about the weight loss, excited where I am right now. I'm not where I expected to be with the weight loss, but I got to tell you, this week was a big, big win because when I saw the 261 on the scale, that really told me I'm so close to the 259 milestone, and um, that's a really big milestone for me. I don't know why, but I guess it's because, I mean, some of my friends are in the 250s, and I've always been up over 300, and just a kind of be in that same weight class as them um for some reason it's it's exciting so okay um i think that i think that's it all right i'm gonna take you upstairs and we can look at the remote of the drone here's the christmas tree looks pretty nice and the train my son has been destroying the train i put the train up last night all right, so here we go. And uh, might be kind of noisy because the girls are watching television. Here's the, this is the, the remote. So my phone, if I wasn't holding my phone, would fit right up in here. And then the control sticks and lots of other fun buttons, so. All right, until next time, guys, talk to you soon.